tell you what, I don't need a putter or these right here. If I left those with you, would you do 40 bucks? Uh... Good morning. Good morning. Am I too early? I, you know what? If you find something you want, we'd be happy for you to take it. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't think it's particular at this point. How much are your records? Um, I think he said like a dollar a piece. Okay. Can I go ahead and pay you? Uh, pay her? I've got um, two posters at a dollar each. The stereo is three, so that's five, uh, um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you're getting this? Uh huh. These two. Three, four, five, six, six seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. All right, cool. Um, Works for me. Um, Somebody's saying good morning. I know. <laughs> Does he like attention? Yeah. 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 yeah it's Joker. Um, Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Yeah. Oh shoot! How did I miss that one? I found one more for two dollars. So I'm gonna buy that poster. All right, cool. I'll load um, some of this up. I'll have to come back for the rest. All right, that works. There you go. Thank you, ma'am. All right, thanks. I got fifty on that, and I'll tell you, I just put a new plug in it, but I can't get the plug seated right, and it doesn't start. But I know if it wants to kick over. I mean, you know, I haven't used it in two years, but it ran then. And how much are you asking for? 50. 50. Yeah. Or I'll listen to an offer. Uh, can you find that? No, I don't. Sorry, no, I don't. Maybe what? Pocket knives. No. No. Take one like this. Posters are not for sale. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I probably should put a sign on them or something, but. No, I. Uh, a few. Uh, I know that those hubcaps, they fit a Camry. My wife had a Camry and they had a sort of nose of popping her hubcaps off. Yeah. Those things are interesting. I don't know why the cars are fit. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a funny thing, right? Yeah. How come they, oh, you had two of these and you have all one of them? Yeah. Okay. I feel like it's pretty well on the trail. 
I'm going to get some books. Do you have a bag I can put them in? Uh, we have a box. That'll do the right job. How about this one right here, sir? Perfect. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, this paper's in I'm about to buy out your whole library, it looks like, here. Well, you, that's all right. You can walk away with my youth. Don't feel guilty. I might need another box. <laughs> Twenty one, twenty two, three. Twenty four bucks. That's twelve bucks. That's and then I got two mugs. Uh that's another dollar. Thirteen dollars I owe you. Alright. That's great. Thanks. Thank you very much. Oh, enjoy them. Good luck with the sale. Thank you got you. a great day for it. Yeah, that's for sure. Morning. Morning. How you doing? Pretty good. How are you? Doing great. That's cool. How much are your golf clubs? Well, that set right there, 50 bucks. 50 bucks with the woods and everything? Yep, with all that. And the bag? Yep. And then how about these miscellaneous clubs? Well, they, they just, if you want them individually. Do you have the three and four iron? No, they. You got the hybrids instead? Yeah. Tell you what, I don't need a putter or these right here. If I left those with you, would you do 40 bucks? Uh, sure. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. All righty. All right, guys, I'm back at the warehouse. I found a lot of stuff today. I think this was maybe my best garage sale day in like a month, maybe of the year so far. I found a lot of good stuff. I got it all pulled out. I'm going to show you what I found. At the first sale of the day, I got a handful of things. So I got this Pyrex bowl for a dollar i'm going to give that to my friend krista then i got this radio it's not vintage just made to look vintage but still has a cool look that was three dollars that's going to go in my antique booth then i got some records there that i'll also put in my antique booth let's see give us a wink alice cooper i like that snake there that's pretty cool the dramatics we've got the partridge family and i think that is it also at that sale, I got some posters. Um, you can see the frame on one of them is like popped out, so I gotta put that back in. This right here caught my eye. I think this is the same artist that did the uh, design for Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. Ralph Steadman, I wanna say that says. Vintage Dr. Gons. I just thought that was super cool for a dollar. I had to buy that. Then I got Notorious B.I.G. for a dollar. Both of those posters will go to my antique booth. And then I got this Pink Floyd, Wish You Were Here. And my brother-in-law, Brennan, is a huge Pink Floyd fan. So that is going to go to him. I got a bunch of sports books at one sale. They were 50 cents each. I got a total of, I want to say like 22 of them or something. There was quite a bit. And I didn't realize that at the time, but a couple of them are signed. So we got a Joe Morgan book here. A Life in Baseball. And there's the signature right there. Best wishes, Joe Morgan. And then there is a Sparky Anderson that's signed as well. So really hard to go wrong with, the, with those for 50 cents each. Anytime you guys see sports books at sales, um, you know, open the cover because a lot of times you'll find signatures in there. I also got a couple of mugs at that sale. They're down here somewhere. First is this Kermit the Frog Muppet News. You see he's got a little like microphone. It's got a couple of chips there on the edge, but it was only 50 cents. So I had to get that. And then this one, I thought was really cool, has this sun design, and on the bottom it says, made exclusively for Starbucks Coffee Company. 
And I've seen Starbucks logos on mugs before, but not one like this. So it might have some age to it. Might be worth a little bit. Might be worthless. I don't know. But 50 cents, had to take a chance. Also got some golf clubs at one sale. We've got a set of Ping Zing irons. And there are four Callaway Woods and a tailor-made bag. I got all these for 40 bucks. I think the irons, because it's only five through sand wedge, normally there's a three and a four iron. I think I could probably get, I don't know, maybe 75 bucks for those. And then the woods, if I put them all together, I might get another 30 or 40 bucks. And then the bag, I'll try to sell locally for 25 bucks maybe. Halfway through the day, my camera died on me and I completely forgot to bring extra batteries. So all this stuff here I got after I was filming. I got this Layer Ever aluminum pot for five bucks. These are actually comping out around 50, believe it or not. It's a little bit dirty. I'm not really totally sure how to polish aluminum. So if you guys got any tips or tricks on polishing aluminum, please let me know in the comments. Got a pair of Heelys, pink uh, size one for girls. They're pretty clean too. I don't think they got much use. I paid eight for those and they're actually selling around like 30 or 40. I got this really cool Stroh's Beer Johnny Bench Clock truck johnny bench distributing company i just thought this was awesome and it's got his uh little glove right there johnny bench distributing company five i've never seen this before i only had to pay five bucks for it so i thought that was a really neat find also got this ti inspire cx calculator lady was asking 40 and i got it for 25 and it seems like it's selling around 80 to 90. i was kind of surprised at how high it's selling to be honest then i got these Play School Puzzle Town. So Richard Scary, Dr. Lyons Medical Center, and Mayor Fox's Town Center. Those were a dollar each. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.